Hey everybody, hope you're doing well. I'm uh, actually sitting, standing here in uh, my neighborhood in Gainesville, Florida, and I uh, drive past this spot every day, <clears throat> pretty much. And over the last couple years that we've lived here, I've seen it get bigger and bigger, and I just wanted to take a minute to talk about it. Uh, one of the things that uh, we see here, and I'm gonna flip the camera around, is uh, St. Augustine grass over here in the distance uh, with Bermuda grass here close up. And this Bermuda grass patch, you can see, extends all the way up here to where the St. Augustine grass starts again. Uh, it's right along the retention pond outside of the clubhouse here in the neighborhood. But uh, one of the things that's happened is over time, the Bermuda grass patch here has gotten bigger and bigger as it's taken over the St. Augustine grass. Uh, that's not actually a surprise. Uh, Bermuda grass tends to handle uh, some of the abiotic and biotic stress a little bit better than St. Augustine in some, ca some cases. This is not an irrigated location. So that means that, uh, it means that the, uh, particularly the drier parts of the year, uh, it has a little bit of an advantage over the Bermuda grass because it, or over the St. Augustine grass because it can um, hold on and, and bounce back from that drought stress when uh, the rain starts again. And ultimately, um, you know, it, it's more aggressive in its lateral growth and will choke out the St. Augustine grass over time uh, as it continues to spread into the St. Augustine grass and start uh, kind of taking over that space uh, for nutrients and water and light. So uh, it's one of the things that makes Bermuda grass management difficult uh, when you get it into St. Augustine grass because it is so aggressive. The other thing that makes it difficult is that they're both warm season grasses and selective removal of Bermuda grass from St. Augustine grass can be quite a challenge, if not almost impossible. Um, anyway, I just wanted to share that with you guys. Uh, if you like the content you're seeing, uh, please hit the subscribe button, uh, like the videos, drop any comments in down below that you have in terms of questions or things that you'd like to see, and we'll talk to you soon. Go Gators!